in this video i teach how to draw plane scale or how to solve numerical of plane scale so first we understand the problem statement for a plane scale draw a scale 1 cm is equal to 1 meter okay so by using this data we can find out the representative fractions to read decimeters to maximum distance of 6 meter means maximum distance we need to indicate it is the 6 meters so on it a distance of 4 meters and 8 decimeters means on the scale we need to indicate or we need to show 4 meter and 8 decimeters means here the two units are there one is the meter one is the decimeter means for constructing the scale basically we are required a various four parameters first we require the units okay so one is the meter second one is the decimeters second we require the representative fractions so in a some numericals the representative fraction is directly given here it is not given but the scale is given so by using this scale we can find out the representative fractions third data we require that is the maximum distance so here maximum distance is given the six meters and fourth we need to find out length of drawing means what is the length of drawing for the six meter that we need to find out so first we find out the representative fractions so we already know that representative fraction rf is equal to dimension of drawing divided by dimensions of object so here dimension of drawing is one centimeter and the dimension of object is one meters okay so it is one centimeter divided by one meters now here that is a different unit are there one in centimeter second one is in meters so we know that in a one meter that is a hundred centimeter is there so one meter is equal to hundred centimeters so instance of one meter we put hundred centimeters so our representative fraction is one upon 100 now next we find out the length of scale so equation of length of scale is representative fraction into maximum distance so we we know the representative fraction it is a 1 upon 100 maximum distance is 6 meter so 6 meter is converted into the centimeter 1 meter is equal to 100 centimeter so 6 into 100 it is a 600 centimeters and if you don't know how to convert the various units for that i already make one separate videos that is a various units of scale for that the link is provided in a card or in the descriptions from that you can watch that video so what is the length of scale length of scale is the 6 centimeter means 600 divided by 100 so answer is 6 centimeters so next thing we need to draw the 6 centimeter long lines okay so draw a line 6 centimeter long and divide in it in a 6 equal parts and each part will be represent larger division units okay so here two units are there one is the six uh, sorry one is the meter and the another is the decimeters so the uh, first we draw the six centimeter long line by using the scale and pencils okay so this is the six centimeter long line and this line is divided in a six equal parts means one part is equal to one centimeters so here we divide in a six equal parts then after we give the numbers okay so zero number is start after the first parts in a plane scale problems okay so here zero one two three four and this is a five now subdivide the first part which will represent second unit or fraction of first units means our first unit is four meters okay from this zero to five is used for indicate the meter and for indicating the decimeters so means left side from the zero is indicate the decimeter means it is a part of first unit so here zero to ten means this part is indicating decimeters so in a one meter that is a ten decimeters are there so this part is also one meters and in a one meter ten decimeters are there so we divide this one centimeters in a ten parts okay so this is the one mm two mm three four five so 1 mm is equal to 1 decimeter so it is a 10 decimeters are there now then after we increase this length that is up to the 5 to 10 mm for getting a look of scales okay so generally we draw 10 mm 
okay so from this we make the one rectangle for getting a look like as a scale okay here on the right side this 0 to 5 is indicate meter so here we need to write down the meter this 0 to 10 is indicate the decimeters so here we write down these decimeters and we also need to write down the what is representative fraction for this scale that is a 1 upon 100 this rf 1 upon 100 is indicate that for a 1 meters we draw the line of length is the 1 centimeters and we need to also write down here plane scale showing meters and decimeters so here we show it is meters and decimeters okay so plane scale is showing meters and decimeters now here we need to indicate 4 meters and 8 decimeters from 0 to 4 okay this is the 4 and 8 decimeter is coming here this line is for 5 6 7 8 okay so here we get the projection lines and indicate 4 meter and 8 decimeters sometimes in a single problems that is a two indications are required suppose they tell you indicate the 3 meter and 2 decimeters okay so from here you need to draw lines and for the 2 decimeter this is the points okay this is the first decimeter this 2 3 4 5 so any things are given that is a 3 meters 3 decimeters 2 meter and 4 decimeters so according to that you can simply draw it after construction of scale mention its representative fractions and name of scale as shown means we need to mention these representative fractions and the scale showing the distance 4 meter and 8 decimeter it has shown means what um, what is the distance are indicates that we need to indicate by drawing the dimension lines so thank you for watching this video if you learn something then like the video and subscribe my channels for watching the more video related to engineering graphics and other subject of mechanical engineering so if you are in first year then you have also subject of basic mechanical engineering so all the chapters of basic mechanical engineering is available so for that you can visit the playlist and don't forget to share with your friends